Hi, myself Boled Devanandra, working as Associate Professor in the Department of CSC, MLR Institute of Technology, Hyderabad. Today's topic is Lex programs. So, one of the examples of the Lex program, here we write Lex program to recognize the keywords and numbers and words in the given statement and also displace those uh, keywords, numbers and words in the given statement. Here, already I told you, Lex program will contain three sections, that is uh, declaration sections separated by percentile, percentile, then rule section separated by percentile, percentile and auxiliary functions. Here in this program, we want to find keywords, numbers, words in the given statement and display those words, numbers and keywords. The first section, see, the first section is included between percentage, percentile open curly braces and percentile closed curly braces. Anything between these two are done in declaration part. Here, we declare hash include stdio.h header file is included in this declaration section then next rule section rule section whatever uh, patterns between percentile percentile and delimiters these are the delimiters between these are rule section here we want to find the we want to find the keywords numbers and words Keywords are like if, then, else, printf or keywords are keywords and numbers, numbers, any number between the range of uh, uh, digits 0 to 9, that is 0 to 9, that is 1, 2, 5 is a number, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1 is a number, so these are the numbers. Words, words is made up of alphabets like that. So, in this rule section having two columns, column 1, column 2, column 1 will contain patterns, column 2 will contain actions, actions are C program statements, C program statements. Patterns are regular expressions. See, in this if followed by R symbol, if R, else R, printf. These three are keywords. Either if R, else or printf. If this is a pattern, the action should be like printf percentage s, percentile s is a keyword. Here, yy text is a unix function that will contain input that input is matched with the pattern whatever input given by the user if that input matches with any of this pattern or regular expression that will be available in yy text so that percentile s yes is whatever value contained in yy text that will be printed that is keyword for suppose input is f if even input is a, if that is available in yy text so that if is a keyword will be printed Next, number 0 to 9 followed by plus. Plus indicates one or more times, one or more times. That is preceding number, whatever may be, preceding number of plus repeated one or more number of times. For example, between the range 0 to 9, 7 is the number, 7 plus 7 may be repeated one or more number of times, 1, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, like that. Any number, we can get this from this pattern, 0 to 9 plus. So that if the input is matched with this pattern, that will be available in yy text. So, number, the given number is a number. Next, a to small a to small z, capital A to capital Z, is a pattern, any input is matched with this pattern that will be printed by using this action. Other than these keywords, numbers, words, 
anything is represented by this dot dot will represent other than these keywords numbers and words or new line if this is the or new line or any other than this keywords numbers and words only the action is echo that is nothing will be done nothing will be done so the third part is auxiliary rule section in this we can write the main program main function here first we will print the printer function enter the string so that we will ask the user to enter the string whatever string entered by the user that will be that will be passed to the rule section by yylx it is a unix function this function will pass forward the whatever input entered by the user to the rule section this is the program to recognize and display keywords numbers and words in the given statement next program next program to identify the capital words from the given input string suppose if you give any input string a b c or number followed by number 10 followed by capital letter s a c followed by small letters m a c so that capital letter words s c a c will be recognized identify the capital words as usual the first part will contain header files included in the declaration section second part will contain a rule section c a to z is the pattern regular expression followed by plus so a to z is a range of alphabets a to z followed by plus plus indicates occurs the preceding letter will be occurring one or more times one or more times so how can you find the word in the given for example this is the lex lex program is to identify the capital words from the given input string see each word is separated by the space each letter each word is separated by the space and also sometimes we will get the word separated by the new line also so we will get this words from this regular pa uh, expression pattern followed by space tab symbol or new line is a how by using this pattern we can identify the words so uh, words are identified by space between the words there is a space or tab space or new line this is the pattern to recognize the words so that we can print that word that word is available in yy text function as usual the third section will contain procedure function auxiliary functions first enter some string with capital words in between the words this yylx will pass the input to the rule section this is the program to identify the capital words from the given input string next lex program to count the number of vowels consonants from the given input the first part will contain declaration section as include as include stdio.h and in two variables are declared vow vowels con consonants both variables are initialized to zero next rule section in the first uh, rule section the first pattern is space followed by tab followed by new line followed by plus we will ignore this any space any tab any new line will be ignore no action will be written in the action part next vowels a e i o u are capital letters a e i o u followed by plus plus indicates one or more number of times of preceding num character so if this occurs the variable v o w will be incremented by one other uh, and uh, we will write a pattern for consonants this symbol cap symbol will use for negation that is a e i o u or a e i o u so other than this a e i o u whatever it may be that is consonant so whenever that will occur consonant variable will be incremented by one this is done in rule section the main the next third part that is auxiliary procedure use will ask the user to enter the input string and this yylx will pass this input string to the rule section after that we will print the value of vowels and consonants next program lex program to count number of lines words spaces and characters in a given statement 
as usual in the first declaration part stdio.h is included and variables number of lines words spaces and characters we are going to print the count that is space count word count line counts and character count all variables are declared and initialized with the value 0 next rule section we have our uh, pattern column and corresponding action column see whenever the pattern new line that means it will increment the line by 1 line count will be incremented by 1 and uh, if line count will be incremented by 1 we will also increment the character count that is who will give the length of the string y y len y y len is a unix function that will give the the string length that is added to cc plus that is character count that is happening whenever a new line occurs and space or tab this input is matches with this pattern space count will be incremented by one character count also incremented by using length of this pattern length of this input and finally word count as usual cap followed by tab space followed by new line so the words will be separated by space tab new lines so that whenever this other than this other than the space new line that is words so that word count will be incremented by one and character count will be incremented by assigning the value of y y length so that is happening in the rule section coming to auxiliary functions as usual print f will ask the user to enter the input y y lx will pass the whatever input from the user to the rule section then finally we will uh, print the values of the variables line count space count word count and character count thank you